what is up y'all your girl is back with another video with another vlog y'all right now i am making the kids something to eat they are home from school speaking of they school y'all like i am ready to leave my hometown like i'm getting irritated okay at this point because i've just been i just been having issues with the school district um because y'all know me and my kids was in alabama for two years and then I brought my kids back in the district. Kyra got to experience kindergarten for like a week or two weeks. Like I remember it was just so short. It was a brief y'all. And then it was like, okay, the pandemic happened. We got to take all the kids out of school and this and that. Then she started going to school from home on a tablet. And then we moved to Alabama. So they never really got a chance to really be inside the schools here in the school district and experience school or whatever but anyways y'all i feel like it's just a lot y'all it's a lot that i'm taking from this but yeah y'all it's just been a lot with this school district and i feel like i don't know y'all i've been praying about it and i'm just like okay lord what is going on what is going on but i have an idea of what's going on but i'm not sure so i'm not gonna be like you know god is saying this or god is saying that but i have an idea of what's going on of why I keep running into these issues after issue after issue, okay? Then I try to go somewhere yesterday to bypass the issue that I'm talking about that I'm not telling y'all about. Y'all still ran into an issue, so it's like, okay, I give up. I give up. So, anyways, y'all, I'm about to um finish making the kids something to eat. And I have to go to the store today. I am so sorry about this lightning. And this is so tacky, y'all. How my bra just sits up. Like, let me cover up. Because this is too much. I need to do this. I need to change my shirt. Because I got sauce all on my shirt. But yeah, y'all. So, I'm making Kaya food right now. She wanted some new news, y'all. Um, So, that's what I made her. And really, that's all we got. Y'all know black folks. We start eating new news when we ain't got nothing else to eat. You know, that'd be like the last resort. I do have to go to the store today, though. I'm going to get some food, and I got to spend cash to go get us some food, y'all. And I'm not sure what to get. I don't know, y'all. I don't know. I'm not sure what I'm going to get, but yeah. I got to go to the store today and get some groceries. Um, Not sure what else I need, but... Yeah, I just wanted to start this vlog off. I need to go change my clothes because like I said, I got a stain on my shirt from cleaning up and I need to finish washing these dishes and stuff. But I guess I'll talk to y'all when I'm going to the store, at the store, whatever the case is. Your girl is on here looking a mess. Y'all, I told myself that I'm going to keep these braids in to the end of this year. Like, I don't care how nappy my hair looks how bad the new growth is because i'm just trying to grow my hair out so i said you know what i'm gonna keep these braids in to the end of the year i don't know i might because i did have another style in mind i've been going back and forth on myself y'all going back and forth on what i want to do to my hair but the plan is to keep these braids in to the end of the year um and then at the end of the year um i want to do a style. I'm gonna do a little style in my head um, that I haven't had in a very, very long time. But yeah, y'all, somebody calling me. So I'm going to end this video right here and I'll get back with y'all when your girl is going to the store. We at the store, y'all. And every time I come with these kids, hold on. I spend my I money that I need to spend. Hold on, y'all. Y'all, not paying for this in. Yeah, so I have found clothes. This clothes section, y'all, we have family dollars. They got some nice stuff in here. So we in the baby. clothes the section. Baby oh, yeah, the baby stuff, too. Cause they got some have pretty, a baby cousin. They got some nice little clothes here for cheap, baby. Look at that, $7. They got some jeans for the girls. I was getting Kyra these green ones and then the black ones. And yeah, y'all. So that's what I got her. Pop. Hmm? Get pop. Get pop. Yeah, I want pop. 
I'm gonna get a jug of juice like a big jug. We need some eggs. Kyle, you get the eggs for me? You probably, I should've got a buggy instead of this small little cart thing. Yeah. I can carry it. Okay, let's go get a buggy. DJ. What? Oh, okay. Kaya, you got stuff all on your face. Look at that. White stuff. <laughs> I, I got this. Mm -hmm. And I got a baby doll. So I got. What's wrong with this? I go to freaking school. I like it. I have stuff on my face. Glasses. Thank you. Can I carry you, Mom? Mom can't carry it. Okay. You got my way, boy. Come on. Kids. All right, y'all. So we need some to drink. They didn't raise the price up on this stuff because it's two dollars at the other store. Let's see. It's three dollars here. Mm. Huh? Right, a dollar. But them is small. I could get these for a dollar, and that's more. Kaya, these are bigger and they a dollar. Uh, okay. Let me get grape. Grape mm. is too long. I wanted to get some juice. Some juice. Like apple juice. Because they ain't apple ones. Okay, get this one. We're gonna try this one. Life is expensive. Yeah, life, life is, is very expensive. Okay, come on. Life is expensive for her. It's expensive for her. It's not expensive for you because you ain't got no responsibility. You just here. Enjoying the ride. We are out of Family Dollars, y'all. I just stopped by McDonald's and got the kids some McFlurries. Now we finna go home, y'all. I'm tired. I'm real tired. What is up, y'all? It is a whole nother day. Your girl is back with another video. I am currently at my kids' bus stop, y'all, waiting on a bus to come. Y'all, I look crazy, okay? I really want to take these braids down. Back to what I was saying at the beginning of this video. Your girl just been going through a lot of emotions, a lot of different emotions, y'all. But, y'all, I am so ready to leave my hometown, okay? I just don't feel that this is a place that I can just dwell in and raise my kids in and all of that. I love my family, y'all. It's like part of me want to stay in my hometown. And this is me being transparent with y'all because I know it's going to be some folks on here that be like, girl, you need to sit down somewhere. You don't need to be moving your kids here, there, this, and that. Y'all, I actually asked my kids, do they want to stay here? They don't even want to stay here, okay? They don't want to live in our hometown, y'all. But part of me do want to stay here in my hometown because of my family. Like, I want to be in my nieces and nephews' life. I want to be in their life. I want to, um, I want to be the best auntie I can be, y'all. I just want to be here every step of the way, like, for my nieces and my nephews and stuff. But then again, y'all, I have learned since giving my life to God that, you know, we cannot be attached to places and things and people, you know, if he's calling us to do certain things or calling us to move to certain places or whatever the case is, y'all. He has taught me how to be content with just him, y'all. Even when my kids get grown and, and they go on their own journeys, you know, and they move, you know, to a whole new state than where I am and take their family and move somewhere else other than where I am, I have to be okay with that. Like, I literally have to be okay with that. It might hurt, it might be sad, but I'll have to be okay with that. But yeah, y'all, so that's what I'm going through right now. Like, part of me just don't want to be here no more. I'm just tired, y'all. I don't want to be here anymore. I've been here long enough. And then it's like the other part of me just want to be here for my family that's it 
you know i just want to be here for my family then there's another part of me that just want to move around okay i just want to move around y'all know we human we be having our different emotions going through this and going through that and there's other things that i'm going through y'all that i cannot talk about publicly and and i could i mean i could say this like y'all know that i am a single mom i have four kids and that can get hard okay just um you know raising my kids by myself and trying to focus on everything but overall y'all overall how i feel and how my kids feel based on what they told me we ready to move we are ready to go but we shall see but yeah y'all so i am ready to take these braids down because i miss my hair i miss my natural hair but we're gonna leave it up i guess i'm gonna just talk to y'all until the kids come or maybe I should just, mm, I kind of want to listen to my music, listen to my favorite song. Um, I just found a new Christian rapper, y'all, and he makes some fire music. Like, y'all, every time I come across, every time I come across a good Christian rapper, I be like, Lord, these folks is anointed. Like, baby, these Christian rappers out here is anointed y'all they is anointed okay i'll be out i'll be over here turned up to some christian rap music y'all i also listen to i love all christian music i love all christian music they got some christian rap that'll make you think that it's secular music because of like the beats and the sounds but they be really talking about god really be talking about jesus for real and and y'all i just love it okay i love it i love music that make you just love jesus even more so yeah y'all so that's it y'all i'm gonna listen to my music and then wait for my babies to come back then we about to head back to the house It look like you got a neck brace on. <laughs> I'm turning a new thing, making me stronger, yeah, yeah. I see sin my life for him, yeah. I see my life for him, yeah, yeah. Ooh, wow. I can't understand, you're a perfect man. Got the whole world in your hands, but you still reaching out for me. Ooh, wow. Why you love me too? I'm nothing like you. Opposite of holiness was what I was, but I'm to you. See my soul and could you see why? Cut my hand high, could you see why? that we just came from the dentist appointment with Kyra. Kyra was at the dentist, y'all. My baby got her teeth cleaned and all of that, y'all. She don't have any cavities, so that's good. Um, I was also at the dentist, y'all. I got my teeth done as well. I got two wisdom teeth, y'all, that I need to get taken out. I already got two other wisdom teeth in the back taken out on this side, but I had to get my other two wisdom teeth taken out on this side. Right now, they're not bothering me, but um, I'm gonna get those two taken out. But your girl is carefree right now. My mama is watching my kids. My mama and my stepdad, y'all, watching all four of my babies. Um, I'm about to go to the store and get some groceries. We're about to go grocery shopping, so I'm gonna take y'all with me. I was just opening up this mail that I got. This is um DJ medical card. Yeah, this DJ medical card. Also got to ship off a product today. So I got to do that. Like your girl be doing, I've been, I've been getting into some things, y'all. Legal things, okay? I've been getting into some things, y'all. And um, so far, y'all done made two sales. But yeah, y'all, so I'm going to take y'all to... The store with me. We finna go to Walmart. Y'all know I stay at Walmart. Oh, 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 oh 
gon' use Proverbs 31 with it, huh? Yeah, I see, I see. I oh, you Proverbs 31. I see, I see. I yeah, oh, you Proverbs 31 with it, huh? I see. Oh, you virtuous, yeah. Faithful, faithful. All around, hold it down for the crib. I know you won't trip. When I tell you, got me talking. And we gotta do what he said. I know you don't trust it. Oh, you a winner over many. And we wait until we ringed up. You ain't even trying to tell me. I know it ain't plenty like you, cause you different. I know you was God given. And he take away I'm just praying that you stay You stay, you stay Yeah Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, you Proverbs 31 with it, huh? Yeah, I see, I see I, Oh, you Proverbs 31 I see, I see I, Yeah Oh, you Proverbs 31 with it, huh? Still fit the Lord, feed the needy and the poor. Who can really ask for more? Oh, in the dress game, modest. All praise to the highest. All oh, praise. I just gotta give thanks. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, you Proverbs 31 with it, huh? Yeah, I see, I see. Ah, oh, you Proverbs 31. I see, I see, I see. Ah, yeah. Oh, you Proverbs 31 with it, huh? Ah, I see. Oh, you Proverbs 31. I see, I see. Ah. Yeah. Oh, you. All right, y'all. So your girl made it out of Walmart. So I gotta put a lot of stuff up. Um, so now I'm about to head to the house so I can put all this stuff up, y'all. I am exhausted. I am tired, okay? It's hot now. It was colder earlier, y'all. That's why I got this sweater on. Got my little sweater on, y'all. This is giving cowgirl. Look at this. It's giving cowgirl. That's it for this video. I hope y'all enjoyed this vlog. Make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, and I'm gonna see y'all in the next video. Oh, you Proverbs 31 with it, huh? Uh, I see.